Hello, my name is Claire and I'm the vicar here at Workley and Farney and we just thought that we would go live to update you a little bit on what's going on in the next few days and weeks here. As some of you are aware, earlier this week some of the core team tested positive on a lateral flow test and one of those subsequent PCRs was positive and we're still waiting for some of the results of others. So that's why we had to transfer the Christingle online. It was a really, really difficult decision to make because we know it's really important to so many people and we love it as much as everyone. And to be perfectly honest, we'd planned a corker, but we didn't want to risk the health of those volunteering because they really, really matter to us. And we also don't want to wreck the plans of people that are coming either. So in the end, we decided it was the best thing to do. But, do you know, we're just really grateful that we got so much done before COVID wrecked some of those final plans. There were the Knitted Angels, the Christmas Fair, the Advent Course, Messy Church, Confirmations, Carols by Candlelight. The pop-up nativity was an absolute blast Figgy the Pony, we salute you. And of course, the drive in carols. The brass band and the other band were absolutely superb. And we had a great night. We were just foiled at the end. Except, it's not really the end. We're hoping, pending these final few PCR results to come back in, that we will be able to gather on site for Christmas Day. We'll keep you informed on this Facebook page, so please do keep a look out on it. But also, we've got so much planned for next year. We've got a watch night service on New Year's Eve. That's online. It was always going to be online, so that's okay. It's a traditional ancient service that helps us to acknowledge the last year and then lift our eyes up for all that's a year to come. It's probably something a lot of us need. We've got a load of special services coming up in the new year too. We can stuff them with candles even if the sun is shining. So they're all coming up. We've got some fantastic courses lined up that are open to everyone too. One of which is a four week resolve course. It starts in the first week of January and it helps us to keep those new year's resolutions. It's got psychologists and medics. It's really good. We did it last year and it's fantastic. But if you want a bit of help in keeping those new year resolutions, perhaps you're just finding winter a bit tough and the COVID stuff a bit anxiety inducing, come along to the resolve course it starts in January. We've also in January got a welcome evening, a priest, a pie, and a pint. We're so excited and looking forward to it. And we'd love as many people to come along to come and enjoy a free pint of pint and find out a little bit more about what the life and work of your church is all about. You might wonder what on earth vicars do in the week. Come and find out. You might be interested in having a christening or wedding. Come and find out. You might just want to get a little bit more involved. Come and find out. You might just want a free pint of pint. Well, come along too. Look out for stuff about that coming soon. We've also got loads of special events planned. We've got a Benefactor Sunday, a Vision Sunday. We've got messy group, uh, sorry, messy churches coming up. We've got toddler groups. We've got our Friday feeling, which is those carousels of coffee morning, knit and natter, messy vintage. They're all going to be going again too. And I haven't even got towards Easter yet. So, although we're moving our Christingle online um, tomorrow, Christmas Eve at 4pm, we'd love you to join us there. But let's also remember the reason why we're doing all this. And that's because we're gathering about around somebody who literally has transformed our lives. His name is Jesus Christ and he is interested in our day-to-day -day reality, in our highs and our lows and the bit in the middle. It's been disappointing, really disappointing that we can't gather in person for our Christingles. But we know this, that whatever life throws at us, Jesus remains. And his invitation to follow him, to invite him, his light and his hope into our day-to-day -day realities remain. And so can I just end this little live thing by saying this year, do come and be part of St John's here at Work in Farnley. Whether that's for our special services, whether it's for a Christingle or wedding or something special, whether you want to come and be part of it at the very beginning of exploring faith, maybe you've just got a hunch, a niggling feeling that won't go away, well, come and explore it with us. Or whether your faith is rooted from years and years of being in a relationship with Jesus. Or maybe 
Maybe you're looking to be part of a community where you can make some new friends, where you can get a bit more support, or maybe a community that might help you to see things from a different perspective. Come and be part of our community here at St John's, where there are no entry requirements, no hoops to jump through, no demands made. Come, because it's Jesus who's inviting you here. And in the meantime, do take care. Stay safe. And if you ever need some prayer or a listening ear, do get in touch. And whether we're online or on site, we just pray that all of us here at Wortley and Farnley and beyond will have a super Christmas, however that looks. Thanks for joining us. Take care. Bye-bye.